sometimes Hulk smash. And sometimes Hulk roar. But sometimes Hulk suck. Hey, guess what? He's doing all three in his latest game, The Incredible Hulk. Although there is a story of sorts, it basically boils down to this. Hulk smash, Hulk smash everything, Hulk never stops smashing. Mission after mission after tedious mission finds everyone's favorite green juggernaut smashing up New York for no good reason. Other than, well, that's what he do or does. He smash. Kind of reminds me of another game. But with way more glitches. Because when things in the world of Bruce Banner aren't being smashed or exploding at the slightest touch, they're defying physics by disappearing and appearing at will. Aside from physics, the game defies logic in general. Can you carry me? For instance, when did Tony Stark get so angry? The upside, even though it all looks the same, just like, well, at least there's a lot of it. Your Metropolitan Playground is huge, so if all you want to do is destroy well-known New York landmarks, there's no shortage. That's more than I can say for, you know. Plus, when you destroy something, you'll unlock a handy reference card that the Hulk can then go put in his Things Me Smash scrapbook. Neato! <laughs> Bottom line, you won't like him when he's angry, you won't like him when he's not angry. You just won't like him. A two out of five.